Hello and welcome to the Your CAD Capture series. This video demonstrates how to control the line style, width, and color of nets in the Your CAD Capture project. The schematic design opened in or CAD Capture, and the work area is currently set to a dark theme. While the application is set to a light theme, default color preferences are shown on the screen, and the application theme is set to light. The schematic theme is set to dark. That is this work area that you see here. And you can change the schematic work area from dark to light. The default colors for all the objects in the schematic are changed. So these are the default color settings for the light theme. And you can see the work area now is shown in a light theme. Change the work area back to a dark theme. Most of the objects in the work area will be displayed as white on a dark background, so these are the default settings when the schematic is set to a dark theme. So here, the wire is a green color, the part bodies are orange, which is determined by the menu we just saw. In the color preference menu, you can change the color of all the objects like wire, bus, part body, and many more. Let's go ahead and change the wire style, width, and color. I'll click on this segment and right click to access the edit wire properties menu. Here I can change the line style, line width, and color of the wire. Click OK to make the changes. You can see the selected segment changed. Right click on the segment and click on edit wire properties to change the setting. I'll change line style, line width, and color of the wire to default. Let's suppose we want to change the color of the VCC wire, and you want to apply the changes to do that everywhere it goes in the design. So let's go ahead and select it, then we'll right click. And instead of using the edit wire properties, this time we'll use the edit net properties command. Now it brings up the same menu, but everything we do now will be applied to the entire VCC net. So let's go ahead and change the line width and assign the color red. Now you can see the change was applied to all wires in the net on the current design. Let's go ahead now and take a look at another net. Let's say, for example, we wanted to work with the clock net here. Select it, right click edit net properties again. And this time, let's go ahead and change the line style to a dashed line style, leave the line width default, and let's pick another color this time and click OK to apply the changes. You can see its color and dashed line style are changed. Here's another example of manipulating the properties on the net. Let's go ahead and select this bus, right click and select edit net properties again. Let's go ahead and use a different color for this particular bus click OK. And you can see the entire bus turns to the assigned color. We go over to page 1. We also see the same color assigned to that bus. So it's been done at the net level. To restore this bus back to its default setting, select the wire, right click, edit net properties, and select default in the color field. That returns it to its default settings as defined in the Options Preferences menu. That's all the time we have now for this video. Thanks for watching.